Hey, this is Jorge Cortez. Let's do a bypass on an iPad second generation that has activation lock. You will need a Mac running High Sierra. That's the best. And you're going to need Sliver, the latest uh, edition they have from AppleTech752.com. Let me show you. Let's see if it is here. You go over his site, downloads, and it's got all the, uh, the requirements you need are here. And download here, Silver Mac, Sliver Mac, latest version. It's got all the other versions, but just get this one here. And you're going to need an Arduino with the USB host shield. You're gonna need the program to run it, which is the Arduino over here. I have a, a, a tutorial on how to set it up. It's in Spanish, but it's actually very easy to get it, to understand it. Okay, and uh, you need, we need to uh, get the iPad into DFU mode and then run the exploit from the Arduino. But we have to program the Arduino using all the exploit this has and has to be with this number, 8940. It won't work with other ones. So I already uploaded, you just press this little arrow and it will upload it. Now, okay, first thing we need to do is get this into DFU mode. And we do this by turning it off all the way out. Slide the power off, so wait a few seconds. And then you're go we're going to press three seconds the power button. And after three seconds has gone by, press the home button for 10 seconds and release the power button. I need both my hands, I don't have a tripod right now to do the first part. After 10 seconds have pa gone passed by, the computer is going to recognize it. You see? It recognizes us and connect to iTunes to restore. You close iTunes. And now we need to connect our, connect this to our Arduino and connect the Arduino to the computer. Once we connect it, it will start loading, but we need to open up the monitor. You hear that? That's my neighbors. Okay, you go into tools over here and you need to select the Arduino Uno and the port, again, Arduino Uno. And then the serial monitor is already running. Just wait until it finishes. If it goes on, okay, it says done, easy. Okay, now we just connect the Arduino. Disconnect the iPad from the Arduino and go into the computer. We're going to get iTunes to recognize it again. There you go. And restore from iTunes. You can close that. You can close the Arduino program. And you go into the, the tool, into A5 devices iPad 2 and I like the exploit here the alternate and load it it's going to ask me to disconnect for five seconds in a moment there you go one two three four five and connect it click continue there's already a change see that okay, let's click continue and the script is going to start rolling any moment now. 
There you go. And then Apple Tech's logo over there. It's already been sent. Press OK. Then relay device info. Let me just get closer so we can see. And got it. Now the lead setup app. This is very important. It's gonna go from bright to dim. So I'm gonna press over here and take a look at this. There, it's, it went dim, so we gotta, because it's giving us this notice here, very important. Wait for the round list, this logo to go from bright to dim, then click the lead setup up again. Okay, it, it already went dim. Let's press dismiss. Again, the lead setup up. Now we have to wait five seconds. Three, four, five, and click okay uh delete setup up again now we're gonna hold the power button and the home button at the same time to reboot it press okay and let's go i'm gonna do it with two hands so i'm gonna pause it and it it restarts It's actually pretty easy. Once you get everything to get it up and running. Now, also, this is very important. There are four iPad 2 versions. That it's 2.1, 2.3, 2.4, 2.2. Sorry, I missed up 2.4. And uh, um, this will only work from 2.1 and up into 2.3. There's a special program for the iPad 2.4. Uh, and once I get one of those, I'm gonna do it to show you how to work, how it works. And sweet, and there you go. It's up and running. Thank you.